uh, let's see here, going over my list here, uh, 100, about 170,000 individual mental health consultations. So it's just a really good charity to donate for, and hope you continue to do so. Um, I've got a few more comments here, so let's go ahead and do it. Uh, we have $20 from uh, Jesse Viator. Uh, if loving Oreos is wrong, I don't want to be right. Loving the Minus Infinity Run. Great cross. Please put this $20 toward uh, Super Metroid 100%. Uh, we got uh, $17.17 from uh, Patrick Curley. Um, he's only fin familiar with about 50% of the scheduled games, but all the props for great entertainment for a great charity. I agree. Uh, that seventeen dollars and seventeen cents goes to Mike Tyson's punch out. Yes, it does. Hey, what was that about? You just had a donation just for punch out. No other reason. Trying to get that in as a bonus. Are you going to be able to get audio? Audio sounds like a problem. $5 from uh, Brett Wheeler. According to 30 seconds spent on Google and TV tropes, the Wish Star Adapter, Russ Sage, and uh, Rush Cannon are homages to Renault's Limit Break. The more you know. This $5 goes out to the first person to call it. Uh, $20 from William Johnson. Don't mind me, just getting in on, on the Mega Man prizes. Put the money toward whatever challenge the cho or choice the reader wants. And we get $200 from Daniel uh, Skibinski. Sunaro here, after watching the entirety of AGD, ADG, AGDQ a few months ago and being unable to donate, I felt the need to start off big. That's a big donation. Uh, donation going to killing the animals in Super Metroid. Expect more from me later on. We appreciate that. These are both very different from my. And we're almost set up for UA to bit When you get started, I'm going to steal your spot. Yeah, it's because um, I can talk because it's a three minute run. Since so you're not going to okay. get a chance to hear the mu this music for a long time. Okay, um, and we're good on donations, so I'm just going to get out of the way so Puexel can uh, sit and commentate for the run. Yeah. UA, apparently, we have allegedly people in the chat who did the graphics for this game and the music. Oh, wow. So, no pressure there. Okay. <laughs> Well, we'll see. My personal best is only six seconds behind the world record, but that's really that's unlikely, unlikely, so we'll see. Uh -huh. And uh, we do have a t-shirt sale going on at the right now. Yeah, that is easy to show you. And uh, so go to uh, www.theyeti.com. How many total t-shirts? Are there it's like 50? Yeah, they're like 50. There's a box. There's a box of like 50 random t-shirts. Yeah, that you can get into. So yeah, head over there and uh, uh, let's see. Oh, oh, we mean on this for sale on their website. Yeah, on the like website. Six, six or six seven. Kinds? I thought you meant the box of shirts. Oh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, all right. Uh, for yeah, subscribing to uh, the Twitch <laughs> chat for this event, uh, we're donating half that we receive. We're donating uh, our half <laughs> to uh, Dark Horse. <laughs> And how close are we? I think we're pretty much ready. I think is the audio good? Yeah, audio's good. It's good. Okay, I guess we don't really need to record this run since it's so uh, graphically simple. So is this the mic you're using then? Or do you yeah. Well, yeah. no, yeah, I'm using this mic. Okay. And you're using that mic, I guess. Okay. It doesn't matter if I can all get anyway. Okay. I think we're ready. So since this game has its own timer, we won't be using the uh, uh, landfare timer for this, but uh, anyway. <coughs> If I die in the second room, I'm just going to restart. <laughs> <It's fine>. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, sorry. Anyway. Alright, as soon as I go through the door, start reading. Okay. Alright, the first two rooms are pretty simple platformers, not much to say about them, so watch and enjoy. The third room introduces the first rule, don't touch yellow blocks. This is the one rule that remains throughout the entire rest of the run. Breaking any of the rules causes death. Fourth room introduces don't touch the sides of blocks rule. Fifth room introduces the don't walk left rule. You can still jump left, but trying to move left while on the ground will kill you. Sixth room doesn't introduce any new rules. It's basically an auto-scroller. Awesome music, though. Mm -hmm. I found that a lot of the indie games have really good music in them. Mm -hmm. yeah. Seventh room introduces the don't touch anything organic rule, including plants and butterflies. 
There's a couple of tricky jumps involving the fans and the butterflies. Aetherum says that you can no longer look at the rules, but you don't look at them in a speedrun anyway, so yeah. Ninth room has a fake exit in the plants, and the real exit is in the right window. Okay. Outside in the clouds, all the rules break except for the don't touch the yellow blocks rule. It's just difficult platforming, trying to catch all of the cycles, which is actually pretty difficult. I missed the cycle, but it didn't lose me that much time. And the final real area is just riding the platform and jumping at the earliest moment to get into the window quickly. And that's it. Not quite. No, I'm done. That's, that's it, just, yeah. Uh, <laughs> oh, nice. Yeah. 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 Underestimate, good job. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> no deaths either. 222. So we're going to listen to this awesome credits music because it's awesome. What's your PB on the Yeah, what is your PB? Uh, 209. And the record is 202 then? 203. 203. It's 203. By Grubu. So flashy goodness is who's in chat right now then? He tweeted us apparently oh, okay. right before we started, so that's cool. Cool. He wrote the music for this game. It's very nice. Yeah, okay, when I posted the YouTube video of one of my practice sessions, I got a copyright notice because apparently he registered the music for this game. <laughs> <laughs> Not a big deal, it just shows my ad. What does the Death code do? Zero. Um, I forget what the code does. I think you. Can, I think it's like supposed to verify that you actually got the time or something like that. I forget exactly how it works. Anyway, so that's Tower of Heaven. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Next up, uh, Street Fighter X Mega Man. We now return you to uh, your regularly scheduled Mallard. Yeah. <laughs>